This target is from back in 1991, when the first Matthew Quigley Buffalo rifle match was held here in Forsyth. Now, more than 30 years later, the event is still going strong and draws in crowds from around the country. We go out in the cow pasture and shoot old time rifles at metal targets for fun. Shots rang through the air all day Saturday at the annual Matthew Quigley Buffalo Rifle Match in Forsyth. The two-day shooting competition was sparked in 1991 after the co-creators Al Lee and Ernie Cornette saw the Western film Quigley Down Under. They put up a bucket target on, and shot at it on Father's Day. There was very few people attended, but for whatever reason it took off. And this is your property? Well... It was, but we're giving it to my children. Lee still attends the events and says he always enjoys seeing the crowds return to his family's property. This year, more than 600 shooters signed up to compete. This is one of the biggest ones we've had for a while. Categories range from first-time shooters to father and son or father and daughter teams, and it's all benefiting the Forsyth Rifle and Pistol Club. It allows our club to give away scholarships and do other work for the community as well as, well, it's a lot of fun. Trent Paffinger is the president of the club. He and his daughter Lauren have been attending the Father's Day weekend event for as long as they can remember. It's just a fun thing and it's always the Quigley on Father's Day. Another father-daughter duo also continues to return year after year. I always want to beat them, even if it's Father's Day. Danica Gamble plays second overall in last year's match, but has some major competition this year, her own father. I got a seven out of eight on the buffalo, so good work. doing good. But it's not about winning for the gambles. Do you feel like you're bonding with your dad when you're here? Yeah. Or the Paffingers. It's great family time. I, I love spending time with my daughter. <laughs> yes. Hopefully she I do too. likes it, hanging out with me once in a while. It's simply about spending time together as a family while benefiting the small town. It's just turned into something amazing for a little old Forsyth, Montana. In Forsyth, Kelsey Marison, MTN News.